Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Assalamu alaikum everyone. Today I'm going to do another tutorial on assembly to machine code conversion. Recently in the discussion with my students, I, uh, I had a very interesting question and I noticed that that machine to assembly to machine code conversion involved uh, some other procedure which we never discussed on our channel. So uh, in this video tutorial, I'm going to discuss that specific case uh, and that specific case relates with uh, when we talk about memory to accumulator or accumulator to memory. Uh, that means uh, either you are moving your data from memory to accumulator or accumulator to memory, right? So this is specifically for move instruction. And furthermore, one need to understand one important point here. Uh, for example, if I'm trying to, if, if I'm going to consider the example, for example, uh, memory means I'm talking about direct memory right so this specific case is about only direct memory we do not uh, we are not concerned with other memory addressing mode like register indirect register addressing mode base addressing mode or base and in index addressing mode so for that is our re previous discussion about assembly to machine code conversion valid and uh, if anybody is of you is not aware about it i will put his i card on this position so you can go and watch it but in this tutorial, we are just considering memory as a direct memory, right? That means direct address will be given into the memory operand. I'm going to show you examples, right? One more interesting uh, case about it, or one uh, in, case, uh, in this specific case study, that accumulator, we are talking about only what? AX. This is known to everyone, right? Accumulator means what? AX. This is known. But you know that it can also be used in 8-bit mode because accumulator uh, in 8086 microprocessor, we are talking about 8086 microprocessor, accumulator can be 8-bit or can be 16-bit. So for 16-bit, everyone know that it is basically what 16-bit, but for 8-bit uh, case, you will always consider AL. You will not consider AH, right? Why? Because AL is always uh from the uppermost byte or for the uppermost byte and if you are considering that it is an 8-bit accumulator so there won't be any uh existence of upper uh higher byte or higher byte of ax register right so that is why uh, in this specific case you will consider 8-bit accumulator so you will use always what al and if you want to uh, talk about 16-bit accumulator, you will always use, use what AX, right? So these are the two important, uh, what you can say, uh, correct uh, case studies of about this case, right? So for example, if I'm going to write, I'm going to write some instructions so that you understand it completely, right? So if, you're some, if somebody write direct addressing mode, let's say one, two, three, six hacks, right? And one going to use what? Let's say AL. This is right. This is right instruction and it will fall in this category. For example, if one is going to write move one, two, three, six hacks, comma, AX, this is also right. But if one is going to write move one, two, three, six hacks, AX, right? So this will never fall in this category we are talking about right now, right? So that means for this specific tutorial, above two instructions are valid if one is going to convert it into assembly to machine code conversion, right? But the, the third instruction, the third number instruction is not valid instruction. If you are, if you, uh, and though it's, it's a valid instruction, but it is not valid for this case. So if you want to convert this specific instruction, you need to follow the previous tutorial, which I've already given you in the I card. Uh, in, so uh, you should follow that tutorial for this instruction, but uh, these two instructions, they should be followed by this method, which I'm going to use in this tutorial. Uh, one more point, which is interesting to note here. Uh, let's say uh, I'm going to write any other instruction, for example, move. I'm going to write VX comma AX, right? So it is registered in direct mode. We know that it is again a memory mode, but uh, uh, this memory to accumulator or accumulator to memory, because you know that AX is accumulator and it is moving data into a memory, but this uh, function is not valid because this is not a direct memory addressing mode, right? So this is again, not a valid instruction. So similarly, any other type of memory mode, uh, it will, this specific 
solution is not going to be work for those specific case. So uh, let's say if I'm going to write some valid instruction, for example, this is the case, very first case I'm going to discuss. So that is move one, two, three, six hertz, comma AL, right? So for that, we need to understand I, uh, what is the source and what is the um, uh, destination. So destination is memory. One can easily see that this is, this is our destination and this is our source. And remember, it is an 8-bit uh, accumulator, right? So we are going to use what? This one, this second option, accumulator to memory and the code, op code will be this one. 101001 and then w w is a size bit as we discussed size is always refers to 8 bit or 16 bit in case of 8 bit it will be 0 it in case of 16 bit it will be 1 right so basically you know that for this specific case if i'm going to write uh, move uh, sorry 101001 right and the size bit should be what it should be 0 because it is an 8 bit operation and then what is the next thing in the uh, instruction or in the uh, format address low and address high. So you can see that one, two, three, six is in direct memory address, but lower byte, we will write 36 hacks directly, comma. I'm going to put comma here just to separate the two byte. Otherwise I know that, you know that this comma doesn't have any meaning in machine code uh, and one, two as in higher byte, right? If I'm going to convert that thing, one, zero, one, zero, one, zero, one, zero means A and double zero, one, zero means two, right? A, two, three, six, one, two, Hacks. This is going to be complete assembly to machine code conversion. I hope you understand this point. Let's take one more example just to elaborate it further. Let's say I'm going to use this time move and uh, I'm going to use opposite manner. I'm, first of all, I'm going to use a 16-bit register uh, or 16-bit accumulator. And then I'm going to use one, two, let's say five, six hacks, right? So this is going to be uh, so now you need to understand this is a direct memory, right? So this is a direct memory case. So it will fall in this category. Furthermore, it is an AX. AX is going to be what? Your accumulator. So memory to accumulator, the upper case will be valid for this case, right? So what will be the opcode? Opcode will be what? 101001, sorry, zero. And W, W should be what? W bit should be one because it is a 16 bit accumulator right now. So one, and then you will write lower order bytes or lower address byte, which is basically five, six hacks. And then higher address, which is basically what? Uh, one, two hacks. And you going to convert it is into A, one, five, six, one, two hacks. So this is going to be the true uh, assembly machine assembly to machine code conversion for this specific case. I hope you have understand this tutorial. And if you have any confusion regarding this specific case of data transfer instruction, remember these, these two instructions are data transfer instruction. We are moving data from memory to accumulator or accumulator to memory, right? If you have any confusion in this tutorial, you can post your queries in comment section. Thank you so much for listening.